APC thought Peter B was a clown and that people like us have lost our mind. Adewole Adebayo. Welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. Please subscribe to our channel to get notified when we post hot juicy news updates. Please click on the notification bell. Adebowale Adebayo, the Social Democratic Party's presidential candidate, has stated that if President-elect Bola Ahmed Tunubu had lost the presidential election, Nigeria would have faced a severe crisis. The lawyer went on to say that each political faction in the previous election had its own political permutation on how the election would play out at the polls. He added that, Members of Tenebus camp believe that no candidate will come close to Asiwaju in the poll. He asserted that the election results continue to astound people who believe Asiwaju should have won with more than 8 million votes. People who are dissatisfied with the presidential election, he claims, have realized that they are not as popular as they thought. I am not satisfied with the outcome of the 2023 elections for reasons I stated before the polls. He continued. Others are dissatisfied because they thought they were the only ones in the field because, because they were in a cocoon. So if you're trapped in an ethno chamber, you keep repeating yourself. Nigeria would have been in a state of emergency if Terimbo had lost their election. This is because those in his echo chamber assumed that no one will ever approach him. They thought Peter B was a clown and people like us were insane. Everyone has an opinion about the election. When I met PDP member, they warned me not to waste my time. Huh. Hey. Let me smile. Hey. You see, eh? You see this particular election. This election opened the eyes of almost everybody. People waiting say not only them be the one and one, be the all and all, say not only them may be the champion. They have given them as in another thought, you know when yeah, you the think say one plus one not two, you they very convinced say one plus one not two, but they can't show you say oh, homo, not only one plus one be two, three minus one will still give you two, seven minus five will still give you two, eight minus uh, six will still give you the same two, even ten minus eight back back will still give you the same two. You go come they look, but they only taught me one plus one now. Uh -huh. You go come no say everything they will. Truthfully, if the election had gone the way of Asiwaju, Bola, Ahmed, Sunumbu, as in it has been that where Asiwaju is standing today is where Peter B is standing, or maybe any other person, <laughs> I think he's standing. Most especially, most especially the presidential candidate of the Liberal Party. If now yet Sunumbu stand, today he stand. <laughs> hey, I want to tell you people that waiting price crisis will happen. A lot of plenty, plenty, plenty things go happen. I they tell you, a lot of things go happen. Will be say you go to ask yourself, say what thing happen? This one that happened now that uh, what's it called? It be like say will be win. Uh, what's it called? Lagos State. That is why the uh, what's it called? The state elections, the governorship election. They no even allow. You know, be like say they allow some people drink water, drop cup. There was violence upon violence upon violence. In fact. Before the election, they started saying, hey, if you know you're not going to vote for APC, you sit down for your ass, you. If you know you're not going to vote for APC, they invaded it to their own. They did it to their own people. They said those ones look like Igbos. In Lake, just because, say, why? For somebody house, just like, say, they come your ass, come beat you for football. Maybe, man, you go Leicester City house, go beat them. <laughs> those ones go, come say, like, like, they look agree. It is a very similar situation. The situation would have been worse. I'm telling you, that is why when APC, they are coming out saying, eh, they are so desperate. They are like, eh, eh, I mean, the presidential candidate of um, Labour Party, he stood this one like, what, is this? what are this ones saying? The same thing, the same thing that APC does. SPT desperation is over the moon. In fact, I started noticing APC desperation before the elections. And I was telling us, I don't understand why people be coming out. And they have not done election and they are telling us that they will win. I beg, they don't write the results somewhere. You know, you remember when they talk this thing? Now? I say I don't understand what's in the sub for APC's camp. They're not even saying that people will vote for them. They're not asking anybody to vote for them. They're saying they would win. I don't understand this. I understand that, yes, if they're good, they're person, they optimistic. But this optimistic is not just optimistic. It is giving something else. It's not giving optimism. 
I'm telling you. Truthfully, I am telling you. This thing where APC they dish out to other parties, most especially to the presidential candidate of the Liberal Party, because I will always say, the just be like saying, I ain't then carry for months. If then dish out to them, well, they will not be able to take it. And the law says, no, they not give it to you if you take. Because I that part of you, that is it. APC should remember that once upon a time, <laughs> PDP did for level then they will, then they form Jagaba and boss. They were also pleading, you know, then they, they do it and they do. Now they don't do for what PDP. Make them not forget, say, as the song you said for PDP time. <laughs> now, so the song was said for their time, oh. <laughs> I just they remind them they can never remain in power for, I remember what I say. No champion rules forever. No champion. So let them get it straight. First of all, if they don't be sworn into power, then it will be unfair to question citizens looking for employment into various offices and positions with either fake or doctored or all level or university certificates. Even in the banking sector, you cannot be employed under a certain age, let alone with a fake or a doctor certificate. Mm? Well, I don't think a sustainable emergence would be a lot of things will come out. A lot. And it's not going to be looking good. Tunimbo will be sworn in with the doctored presidential election results. This is an incontrovertible fact. Well, all I'm saying is that they should be ready for the consequences. And unfortunately, it is not they. We should be ready for the consequences. Because this thing that they did or they're about to do is already like a seed. It's a seed that, and them doing it means then they put them for ground and they water them. And when this thing go, you know, when you go die for ground, come, you know, grow, 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 come bear fruits. <laughs> the harvest, I assure you, is not going to be one fruit. It's not only going to be one seed. It is going to be 10, it's going to be 20, it's going to be 30, 40, 50. So more than they are aware. More than they be aware of what they do. Tunumbu never won any election. He did not even come thought. Every indication shows he never won anything. How come? How come? Um, how come go and nine connive and shut down the server? Mad people everywhere. Make na take a easy. It's not always uh, in the boski is not always the way to go. Okay, this man has said it all. If you like insult him, it is not new because that is a trademark. Anybody that says something that is not favorable to be must be castigated. How? How did you are you sure you read the elections? I mean, you read the news. I'm not sure. Say so you read the news, sure, because if you read them, you know, go can't drop this kind of comment. People like Adebayo, Adewole, opening their mouth wide and saying things without thinking of the meaning and effects of what they say, they cause confusion in the society. I beg, close your mouth. They open their mouth. But you, Uncle, now close mouth is the close talk. <laughs> some people, some people will not cease to amaze me. No, he is entitled to his opinion. Now you say, if you go use open your so you go open your mouth, give your own opinion. Maybe say, you know, go sit well with some people as well. All right, and just note you have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for turning in to listen. Until I come, you'll be next time. Enjoy the rest of your day.